What's up? It's JJ. This is cheap beer for you to drink. Uh, this is the one I was talking about. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. It just says boss really big. I'm assuming these are called boss. It says boss drink like a going to make the assumption it's drink like a boss. Uh, 14% alcohol. 23 and a half ounce can. This thing was 99 cents. So my expectations for this are very, very low. Uh, let's go over these, these healthy nutritional facts. Here we go. A serving size for this can. I don't know if it's the same for Four Loco. We just did the Four Loco seltzer, uh, which kind of came up out of the blue. Uh, and, and not disappointing at all. It's actually decent. Just, just know it tastes like a four loco that's not what this video is about this is about the boss all right uh a serving size is three fluid ounces i don't know if that's what uh, a serving size for a four loco is but i'm assuming it's something close three fluid ounces that means there's approximately eight servings in this 90 calories per serving 90 times eight 720 i'm not a math major but i'm pretty sure this is 720 calories per can. We have ingredients on this too, which is surprising. Distilled water, high fructose corn, corn syrup, fruit punch flavor. So whatever that means, I don't know if that's, I doubt it's actual fruit juice. Fruit punch flavor is what it says. Citric acid, uh, more acid, just sucralose, uh, red dye. Here's what the can says. Drink like a boss. Uh, fruit punch flavored malt beverage specialty. Fruit punch made with natural flavor and certified color. Let's waste no more time. Let's see if this is worth the 99 cents. And I promoted this in the other video as the cheapest alcohol I've seen. And this isn't a sale price. This was just the regular price it sold for. 99 cents for 14% alcohol in a tall boy can. That's just ridiculously cheap. Like, this cannot be good. This just has to be if you needed a quick alcohol fix, and that's not a good idea. Um, so my expectations for this are very low. I just wanted to do it because I was so surprised about how cheap it was. Um, I'm assuming, again, not very good. It smells horrible. This smells terrible. It smells like... I guess like a Four loco. No, I won't even give it that. Four Locos are drinkable. This this is going to be bad. All right, looks like a, uh, a Mountain Dew Code Red. <laughs> I, I'm trying to... This smells familiar. I don't know what it is, but it, it just is going to be awful. Here we go. This is Drink Like a Boss, 14% alcohol. Okay, this is horrible. Don't buy this. If you see this, I'm saving you the trouble. I cannot finish an entire... I can't finish this. I'll try. Yeah, don't drink these. <laughs> it does not taste like fruit punch. It tastes like... Uh... What is that smell? It's just... It's pungent. This is gross. Not even like a medicine fruit punch. I don't know, but it's bad. Don't drink it. But here we go. Uh, saving the day with this. I keep getting comments because I've said in the past I'm going to do a bush light. And I have not. So I'm going to sneak in this bush light to try and save me. Save these taste buds. I already slurring my words. That's bad. Don't, don't buy this. Not worth the 14% alcohol. Here goes nothing, a bush light. I was drinking these these past weekend. This is uh, the Kaysen's beer of choice now. Kaysen was in my Natty Daddy video. And, um, okay, let's take a drink. Bush light's good. Um, what can I tell you about it that you don't already know? 4.1% alcohol. Made by Anheuser-Busch. Um, 
95 calories per serving per 12 ounces. There's just over two servings in this. Uh, that's all I can tell you. I think I prefer natural light to bush light. They're both super cheap. Um, don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong with the bush light. It's actually pretty good. But uh, if I was drinking beer and want something cheap, and they're made by the, the same people, so you might as well just choose the one you like. It, it's just a matter of taste at that point, natural light or bush light. Uh, I like bush light. This is not bad. Uh, but again, I prefer a natural light. This is the updated uh, cheap beer for you to drink, top five. We're putting burger light still at number one. That's my favorite. It's, uh, it's great. Come try it. Natural Light Natter Days. Uh, there is a comment, and I, I wish I remembered your username, but uh, someone said they're just going to be really sad if they see Natter Days go. And uh, I have not been drinking it as much. I've been drinking the Natural Light Seltzer. Um, but I went back last weekend just to try a Natter Day because I hadn't tried them. It was so good. So if you had not had a Natter Day yet, still the top viewed video on the channel again thanks to everyone that supports this just insane channel uh it's been a great ride so far and we're gonna keep doing it but if you had not had an adder days yet you've got to try it they're really good uh so that's my number two labat blue royale light it is a tall boy like this it is 99 cents it is six percent alcohol and it's a really good beer i highly recommend that you try the labat blue royale light if you can find it, uh, you should be able to. Any gas station should have it. I don't know. Uh, Natural Light Seltzer, I have added to the bottom of this cheap beer for you to drink top five because seltzers are so popular right now. And it's one of the cheapest seltzers. It's 6% alcohol. It is absolutely delicious. I put the Aloha Beaches flavor. I don't know if you can see this. I don't know if my mic's in the way. It shouldn't be. I put the Aloha Beaches flavor because it is, I prefer it over the Catalina Lime Mixer, but they're both good. And I think Aloha Beaches, more people will probably like. Uh, it's just a really good flavor. And um, it's got that Sprite. It's got that, just the crisp. It's like your drink. I don't know. It's just really good. Uh, and then Natural Light, I'm putting at the bottom because I was a Natural Light hater at the beginning of this channel. And uh, you can, here's what I'm going to do for those that like Bush Light. I am going to put Natural Light slash Bush. It's just a matter of, of your taste personally. They're both good. They're both cheap. Um, and there's nothing wrong with them. Cheap beer is not bad. That's what this channel is all about. Cheap beer for you to drink. Uh, don't buy this boss. It's terrible. And, uh, it's going right down the sink. This bush light though, I'm going to watch some football, drink some bush light. If there's anything that you want me to review, let me know in the comments. Um, I'm probably just going to keep reviewing the new stuff that I find. I mean, those videos are the ones that seem to get big. I want to do another taste test soon though, with Keystone light and bush light, natural light. I just want to do a big blind taste test and see how that goes. Uh, cause that video was fun. But other than that, you'll probably just see new products or weird, strange stuff like this. And this has been cheap beer for you to drink. Thanks for supporting the channel. And, uh, we'll see you next time with some kind of cheap beer. <laughs>